Ladies and gentlemen, the legendary drummer of Grand Funk Railroad, Don Brewer, joining us here at the Music Universe. Hello, I'm Buddy Jan, and on the phone with me is Don, and uh, we're talking to him today about an upcoming appearance in Bakersfield, California at the Kern County Fair on September 28th. And Don, now I've seen you in concert once in 97 in uh, St. Louis, and uh, it was a phenomenal show. Just curious as to what concert goers can expect to see from you all this year. Well, we, we focus on giving everybody the hits. You know, they they want to hear uh, the grand funk hits, so we give them the staples, foot stomp and music, rock and roll, soul, I'm your captain, closer to home, inside looking out. We're an American band, locomotion, some kind of wonderful, uh, walk like a man, uh, you know, any, all, of the, all of the hits, as well as a few other things. But we like to get everybody involved. We like to get everybody on their feet and uh, having a good time and smiling. And, uh, you know, that, that's, that's what the show's all about. Not only do you play drums, but you also sing, correct? I do, yeah. I'm a singing drummer. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm one, of, one of that breed. That you are, much like Don Henley and Phil Collins used to name, too. I uh, play drums myself, but I don't sing. I'm not even sure how that can be done. But uh, you guys have been together 47 years now, and how is touring different now than it was in the 70s? Well, in the 70s, you know, from 1969 to 1976, we used to do two tours a year, along with two albums a year. We an album and then uh, and then we'd go on the road for 40 shows and it would be you know about 40 shows in 40 days and that, that kind of a thing and now we do you know over the course of a year we'll do about 40 shows you know and, and uh, so it's all spread out and it's a lot easier to do it this way we do a lot of fly dates and, you know we're not just constantly getting on a bus and going on the road so it's uh, it, it's very nice this way and have you ever played Bakersfield before? Oh yes, we uh, I'm, we've been out there. The, yeah, actually, when it, it, Kern County Fair rings a bell to me, so it's it's been a, a number of years since we were out there. But I I do recall playing there uh, a number of years ago. Yeah. Great, that's going to be an awesome show. I'm looking forward to seeing it. Uh, just curious if you guys are working on and are planning to perform any new music. We do have some new stuff, you know, that we've been doing uh, over the years, and we've got a a whole bunch of stuff that we've done since this this incarnation has been together since 2000 so we're going on 17 years of this band and, uh, and over that time we've had a lot of you know new songs that have come and gone and uh, we do currently have uh, Bottle Rocket we've got uh, uh, Lightning and Thunder we've got uh, you know several things that we do but but we really do focus on that you know, it doesn't seem like it matters who you are. That's what fans want to hear when they come to a show. Just the hits and maybe a couple of new ones in here and there. But you've been a touring and selling out shows in uh, the U.S., Canada, Europe, Japan, and South America. What does that feel like after 47 years? <laughs> it's pretty amazing. You know, I mean, it, you know, we never dreamed when we were 20 years old that this, uh, you know, here we are 67 years old. I, I've turned 68 just recently, and uh, I never dreamed. That, that we'd still be doing it, or that we would have generations of people knowing the songs. You know, we, we get up on stage and we see, you know, grandparents and parents and kids and grandkids out there in the audience that all know the words to the song. That's it's just amazing. That is just amazing that you guys have been uh, together with this iteration, you said already, for 17 years. Can you tell us uh, who's in it? Well, we've got myself and Will Shocker, founding members of Grand Funk, along with. Max Carl, formerly a 38 Special. Max is the guy that sang and wrote 38's biggest hit, Second Chance. Also from a band back in the 80s, uh, people remember Jack Mack and the Heart Attack. You know, and so he's probably one of the last blue-eyed soul singers on the planet. Also got Bruce Kulick playing lead guitar with us. Bruce was the lead guitar player for Kiss for 12 years when they took their makeup off uh, back in the 80s. And uh, got uh, Tim Cashin, who's been with Robert Palmer and Bob Seger. And, uh, you know, he plays keyboards and does uh, it does backup vocals. So it's it's a great band. And, uh, it's just uh, you know, like I said, we've been we've been touring with this band for 17 years. And to the many fans that are coming to Bakersfield, whether they're in Bakersfield or they're traveling just to see you all, is there anything you would like to say to them? Oh, we just like to say, you know, be ready to smile, be ready to sweat. Let's have a good time. And a good time will be had by all those attending that show. Again, Grand Funk Railroad coming to Bakersfield at the Kern County Fair Wednesday, September 28th. You can visit kerncountyfair.com to purchase your tickets. Anyone with a ticket into the fair gets admission to the free show. So check it out and be sure to check out themusicuniverse.com for more exclusives as well as news release info, and a lot more. I'm Buddy Jan. Thanks a lot to Don Brewer of Grand Funk Railroad. Take care.